Hello and welcome to Forever Rugby on Forever Sports. This is the review of All Blacks versus the USA Eagles 100. Let me get this right. There were a lot of points. 104 to 14 in favor of the All Blacks. Huge, huge, huge victory. 16 tries to 2. 61% possession to the All Blacks. 36 defenders beaten from the All Blacks. 13 clean breaks to the two of the USA. 213 passes to the 96 of the USA. 18 offloads to the five of the USA. Exceptional, exceptional work from the All Blacks. Tries from Ethan De Groot, Angus Tuavo. Double from Jacobson, Luke Jacobson. A try from Dalton Papali'i. Richie Mwanga, Tupaya, hat-trick from Will Jordan. Beautiful, beautiful game from him. And a try from Damian McKenzie. On the USA side, we had two tries. One from the scrum off of Nate Augsburger and wing Ryan Matchat. The USA really did improve in the second half. But uh, as the scoreline suggests, it was still tough times for them. Really, really a masterclass from the All Black side. Played fantastic rugby. It almost seemed every time they had the ball for more than two phases that they would score. And often that was the case. And I think it was a baptism of fire for Gary Gold and his USA Eagles. But nevertheless, powerful experience. Um, if you can call it that, I don't know. I don't know how much personally, or personally, I don't know how much one would learn from being pumped 104 to 14. But nevertheless, it was a fantastic spectacle. It was actually my first test match watch along. So that was also a good experience. But really incredible performance from the USA. Will Jordan will be causing problems in the mind of Ian Foster. He's always putting his hand up. Um, great games as well from McKenzie. Bridge was really, really quiet. Um, also special mention to Brandon, Braden, Braden Enor, who Played on the left wing from outside center for the last period of the game, made some important runs and came out with a try assist that TJ Pedinata try right at the end. Okay, well, I don't know how much more there is to say, really. It was just an absolute destructive destruction of the USA Eagles. Never really anywhere. I mean, the two tries were pretty decent. Augsburger was the first try. He broke the line um, through what would be a pillar defender from the, the New Zealand defensive line. So for those that don't know, the pillar defender is the, the defender nearest to the ruck. You call it pillar because you're supporting the ruck, uh, you know, in all those different ways you can remember it. So there was no pillar defender. Nate Augsburger sniped that gap. He was left one-on-one -on -one with Damien McKenzie, sent him to the shops. Over was brilliant, and then Matches's try, you know, just giving them real, giving the USA real credit. He one on one, real good job to finish in the corner, and yeah. If I went through all of the All Black tries and try to give you a rundown of who did what and, and all of that, I would one run out of breath, and I would two have a review for twenty five minutes. But nevertheless, um, it was a lovely game. One hundred and four. Points to the All Blacks to the 14 of the United States of America. Excellent, excellent performance from the All Blacks. Master class of rugby. A proper, proper rugby lesson. That's it from me, Dylan Katsia, for your review today. Thank you and good night.